Um, I do want to let everyone know just before we start with our formal program, we will be doing our formal program, we'll have some announcements, give you a little bit of a flavor about Rotary. It's also important that everyone knows that this is a million dollar meal. And what that means is that we're being really cheap. We're buying pizza. Pizza's been purchased by compliments of Rockland Trust. Um, soda's been per uh, purchased uh, again. And we do it on the cheap because we collect our, from our regular members uh, their regular weekly um, dollar figure as well as I believe we're picking up uh, contributions today. All of the dollars today, it's a fundraiser to assist our Rotary International in our, uh, you know, our ability to help eradicate polio from the face of this earth. And we've got a couple of folks here that will be speaking from the Boston Post Polio Association, I believe I said that correctly, who will talk a little bit about their experiences with polio and um, the importance of trying to get this thing sniffed out. Um, Bill and Melinda Gates, obviously Bill from Microsoft, Bill Gates uh, and his bride from their foundation have pledged $100 million. And as long as the Rotary, uh, the Rotary International can match that, there's a $200 million grant that's in the process in order to eradicate this um, you know, terrible disease. So uh, that's where your dollars are going to today. So when you're picking up a piece of pizza and if it's stuck to the top or you don't want your soda, remember the dollars that you're giving um, are for a great cause. So without any further ado, I would like to ask our very own Red Bretagne if he would lead us in the Pledge of Allegiance to the flag. And from our club, and uh, we like to, oh, great, he's here. I'm not going to have to wing it. <laughs> Tom Kazanowski, who happens to be past president and incoming president, will lead us in an invocation. Tom, please. Dear Lord, thank you for allowing us to get together. Oh, by the way, it's a breakfast meeting at 7.30 in the morning on Wednesday mornings at, um, Good Day's Restaurant, thank you very much, in East Bridgewater. West Bridgewater. West, let's call it West Bridgewater on the thing, right? <laughs> and we would love to have all of you join us for that meeting. Um, we have a formal program every single week. We have a great group of folks. So, one of the things that we do during our regular meeting is that our club has got a four-way test of the things we think, say, or do. It's up here for folks that can't see it. And we recite it every single week. So for those Rotary members, they should be able to do it right off the top of their head. And for others, please join me in the four-way test of the things we think, say, or do. Repeat after me. First, is it the truth? Second, is it fair to all concerned? Third, will it build goodwill and better friendships? Will it build goodwill and better friendships? And fourth, will it be beneficial to all concerned? And uh, we want to, first of all, <coughs> commend the Rotary for sticking with the project because it has not been as easy, maybe, as the smallpox eradication. The world situation makes it so much more difficult to get the, the vaccines to, to the different areas. And uh, we had a Rotarian come to speak with us about her experience with volunteering uh, with the program. Uh, she came to our Greater Boston Post. Theaters were closed, pools were closed, you couldn't play with other kids, uh, you didn't, couldn't be in crowds. I didn't remember that because I was too young. But Because that's, I guess, that's mainly where he went. Yeah, that was treated. Like for chronic diseases. You know, like and then he know. said um, they tried whatever, like they would be mud pack them. Yeah, they were you know, hot packs on their. Because at the, at the beginning, initially, the muscle is very, very painful. I don't remember that. Oh, he had it in both legs because yeah. when I did the home health care for him by that time, he couldn't, you know, like he wasn't walking on his own. He was like a hoyer with that. Yeah, yeah. But you know, just the stories. That